Without intending it as a commentary on his successor, I have to confess, I think the Senate will be a much poorer place without Russ Feingold in it. I know that in my next term, I will experience fewer occasions of inspiration because of the departure of Russ Feingold, a man whose courage and dedication to the principles that guided his Senate service often inspired me. I will also miss the daily experience of Russ Feingold's friendship and the qualities that distinguish his friendship, his thoughtfulness, kindness, humor, and loyalty. I have treasured that friendship all the years we've served together. And while friendship doesn't end with a Senate career, I will sorely miss his presence here. I will miss seeing him every day. I will miss traveling with him. I will miss the daily reminder of what a blessing it is to have a true friend in Washington. In his time in the Senate, Russ Feingold, every day and in every way, had the courage of his convictions. And though I am quite a few years older than Russ and have served in this body longer than he has, I confess I have always felt he was my superior in that cardinal virtue. And in my every experience with Russ Feingold, in agreement and disagreement, in pleasant times and difficult ones, in heated arguments and in the relaxed conversation of friends, he was an exemplary public servant, a gentleman, good company, an irreplaceable friend, a kind man, a man to be admired. I can't do justice in these remarks to all of Russ's many qualities are expressed completely, how much I think this institution benefited from his service here, and how much I benefited from knowing him. I lack the eloquence. I don't think he is replaceable. We would all do well to keep his example in our minds as we serve our constituents and country and convictions. We couldn't have a better role model. I have every expectation we will remain good friends long after we have both ended our Senate careers. But I will miss him here every day. And I will try harder to become half the public servant that he is. Because his friendship is an honor, and honors come with responsibilities. God bless him.